Megan. You are truly the woman of my dreams. You are the most beautiful, good and gracious gift from God that I've ever received. I will spend the rest of my life praising Him for seeing fit to join us together in marriage. I vow to love and delight in you for the remainder of my days, Megan, lovingly and continually pursuing you as we work to become more like Jesus. Samuel James, you're the answer to years of my prayers and deepest dreams. You have an intuitive sense of empathy, a quiet strength, and a certainty, stability, and vision that come with knowing who you are and what you believe in. With these vows and my commitment to them, let it be said of my life that I used all I had to love you for as long as we both shall live. Welcome family and friends. We're assembled here today in the sight of God to unite Samuel and Megan in the bonds of marriage. Will you, Samuel, take Megan before God and these witnesses to be your wedded wife? I will. Will you, Megan, take Samuel to be your wedded husband? I will. Successful marriages take place in the context of a loving and supportive community made up of family and friends. So will you, the family and friends of Samuel and Megan, covenant with them in their marriage? Now, by the power vested in me by the Commonwealth of Virginia, I pronounce you husband and wife, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Megan and Samuel, it's an honor and privilege to celebrate your marriage today. Thank you for inviting us all here to witness the beginning of your joyous and beautiful life together. When Megan first started talking to Samuel, I instantly loved him for her. Before Samuel proposed to Megan, I asked him why he loved my sister. I got a long text back from Samuel, and I quickly started crafting a response. Then I got another long text, and another and another. <laughs> it was clear to me that Samuel knew and loved my sister's heart. She is seen and understood by him. When Megan and Samuel aren't hard at work kicking butt and taking names, they have this contagious, fun, silly, and playful side to them that is truly captivating. This is a testament of the joy that they both have found in the Lord. They consistently pour out joy, and for that, I am forever grateful to experience it. Here's to the beautiful story that is your future together. It is yet to be written, but there's not a doubt in our minds that it will be a great story, one of the best. One filled with authenticity, abundant joy, and unmatched determination to achieve the dreams within you. Here's to you, Megan and Samuel and the pages which lay before you. Cheers, cheers. <laughs> I don't know how 
I can follow that. <laughs> I only have one page, so. Megan, you are aloof, random, and weird. <laughs> and those qualities make you the perfect person for Samuel. Samuel, you are stubborn, verbose, and quite a lot to handle. <laughs> Thank God you're Megan's problem now. Samuel, you help ground and focus Megan. Megan, you help calm and affirm Samuel and his identity. You push each other closer to God and closer to greatness. They really are a force to be reckoned with, and I'd like to see anyone try to separate them from each other, because separately they may be successful, but together they're impossible to stop. So toast to Samuel and Megan. Don't ever stop fighting for the love that you share. And may you always use love to be your light in the darkness. To true love.